Hello everyone, this is my son, your highness, call him Johnny. So Johnny is developing, designing and uh, developing a video game and animation. He is using a tool called Scratch and uh, he is going to explain to us uh, what he did. Alright Johnny, go ahead. So what I did is that um, I go to costumes. If I wanna, if I wanna get a costume, I go to choose a sp sprite, or I can paint one. I draw to these, and um, record the sound from here. I can pick a sound, or I can record, or I can just get one from my uploaded um, recording sound. Then when I do all that, I um. I do when I click the green so flag. So that is the coding you did after the recording, right? Yes. Okay. So when I do like when I click the flag, mm -hmm. why I put show mm -hmm. is because because in the end it will hide and I'll mm -hmm. sh in this one mm -hmm. will be shown up. You guys will see it, and when I click the flag. All right. So it's highly interactive and changing. Mm -hmm. I'm hearing a voice now. Yes. And uh, huh, that's interesting. Too big. Wow. Perfect. Well, how I did it was because how I like switched the costume mm -hmm. is because I do switch costume to like costume numbers and um, hide and then wait for 24 seconds and show and it will switch the costume to this one mm -hmm. so, and that why I put show is because if I put hide on the top it will just not show the mm -hmm. everything from the very start yes wow interesting Johnny that's really amazing and you keep it up and make it longer and uh, you know put interesting stories Mm -hmm. and image and make it highly interactive especially when you speak something and if it does if it replies based on your um what you say that would make it a more, much more powerful uh, animation or game whatsoever mm -hmm. you call it all right yes all right i'm impressed really really impressed proud of you son thanks if you guys like this video Please hit the thumbs up and um, probably subscribe. subscribe, yes. Okay. And, right. um...